What's going on guys, Godlike Matt, and I just wanted to talk a bit about my progress, what's been going on. So I know I promised some recent, uh, you know, uh, more things from me, recently, is what I should have said. And uh, it's coming along, I actually just finished recording a new project that I'm starting for you guys, one that I said, I, I talked a little bit about it in my last vlog. That's what I started. I actually just finished recording it today. and um, But the thing is, now I'm trying to edit it in Adobe Premiere Elements, and it's, it's tough. Um, it's going to be exactly like Photoshop in the sense that the day I first used Photoshop to make my thumbnail, it took me a few hours to, like, literally a few hours to learn, like, all the tools and specs and the layout and, and just how to use Photoshop effectively. And it's going to be a while before I can use it very quickly. Like, even even when I go to make another thumbnail, remembering everything I learned is going to be a thing in itself. Like, I, I, I still don't have all this in my head, but I'm trying. Um, I'm trying to learn this stuff because I, I want to know it, like, the back of my hand so that I can use it on the fly, just like my old editing stuff. And, uh, because I need to get used to this stuff, because I dropped so much money on it, right? And this is my, you know, my new standard. Like, I set the bar now a little higher, and now I gotta kind of catch up to the bar I set for myself. So, I've been, I, I know Photoshop, like, you know, uh, I'm still not entirely 100% comfortable with it, but I feel a lot better using it than I did when I first booted it up, that's for sure. But um, today is my first time ever using Adobe Premiere Elements, and I feel so fucking lost. <laughs> and I could just see that it's going to take a few hours to edit what I just recorded, but everything looks great. Like, I'm so excited. Like, I got my face cam up in the corner, edited in, um, and I plan to, uh, you know, totally go the whole nine yards with that shit. I want to learn the program from the bottom up, learn exactly how to use it, master it so that I can make videos on the fly really quickly, and I want to upload it when it's perfect. Um, I really want this video that I just recorded to set the bar for everything that comes after. I, I want I want this to be the start of better quality and it looks good. Like so far I, I'm really excited to get this video out to you guys and I can't wait to see what you guys have to say about it. Because for me it's a big step personally. It's a huge upgrade from what I'm used to. Um I'm really at the same time I'm really out of my element though because I'm uh you know, learning all this new equipment, and uh, for me, I'm when it comes to computers, I'm very slow at learning that shit because it's just so complicated to me and overwhelming. So, but I'm getting there, and I plan to master it. I don't know when exactly I'm gonna have this video out for you guys, but I I'm trying to get it out as soon as possible. Um, and you know the beauty of it will be once that I'm once I'm fully comfortable using Photoshop and Premiere Elements, I'll be able to pump out videos for you guys so much. I just got to keep practicing with those programs, learning how to use them like the back of my hand, and then you guys are gonna get shit way more often. And like I I really want to return to having a video for you guys every day, like even on days when I work. I want to get so ahead of the game. Like, I, I want to, like, if I can, a, a lot of professional YouTubers do this, but they'll record shit ahead of time. Um, they'll record, like, three, four videos in a day and release them, like, one a day. And then, you know, you'll have this backlog of all these videos that you haven't uploaded yet, and that way I can always have content for you guys, even on days where I can't record. So... Like, let's say today I record, like, four videos of this game, this new project that I'm playing. Um, I'd be able to give you guys one video for every day. Um, 
and you know it would uh, it would have that consistency, and you guys would be able to like expect it and and look forward to it, and it'd be really cool. I'd like to be able to return to that because that was that used to be how fast I could uh, pump that shit out, but with the free low budget stuff that I was using, it was very easy to do that stuff because not a lot of work went into it. I just recorded the game and then pretty much uploaded it as is. Um, there was no face cam. There was no editing special effects shit like that. But I want all that shit to be the standard in my videos now. And I know at first they're not going to be that amazing. Uh, you know, like, there's going to be a lot of... Mostly just gameplay, like, and me talking, like I usually do. But I want to, like, put more funny stuff in there, like, um, you know, slow the video down when it would be really funny, or uh, add clips of other stuff to just pop in and kind of, uh, you know, like, let's say I'm referencing something in the video, and then I want the clip to just pop up of whatever I'm referencing. You know, stuff like that. Like, I want to be able to do that all the time. Or if I ever want text to pop up on the screen, um, I, w I want that to be, you know, uh, consecutively in my videos. But that's going to take time to learn all that on this new program that I'm using. But hopefully I can get that to be the new standard. But uh, until then, I'm going to learn the shit out of this program, try and get this video to you guys. And I really hope that it's well received. I'm pretty sure it will be because like I said in my last vlog... It's a game that you guys have been asking for uh, for a little while now, so I'm hoping you guys really like it. But uh, I, I want you guys to know that, like, normally all the roadblocks I've been hitting have been just nothing but frustration and stress and stuff that would hold me back. But not being comfortable with these programs, yeah, it sucks, but it's exciting for, like, knowing that once I learn the programs, which I don't feel like is impossible for me, like I feel like it's definitely doable, uh, once I've learned them to a, a, a decent degree, my videos are just going to be way better. And that thought excites me and encourages me and makes me feel so good about what I'm doing. So even though I'm taking so much time on getting this shit to you guys, just know that I'm taking the time... To really put all my effort into it and to give you guys something that's worth giving you. So I hope you guys can continue to be patient with me. I know I've probably lost so many regulars in the time that it takes me to get stuff out to you guys. Because a lot of people who subscribe to me expected stuff every day. And once I kind of fell off that, um, I, I don't see a lot of my regulars anymore. Like a lot of people that used to be regulars, I haven't seen them in so long. Uh, I don't know if that's just because of, like, time of day or whatever, but it's sad but true. My sub count hasn't really dropped, but it it is really sad to, like, not see all the regulars that I would see every time anymore. It kind of sucks. And another thing I wanted to talk about um, regarding, like, how much time I have to do this stuff, it relates to my situation with my girlfriend, which I kind of want to tell you guys about, because... I know some of you know that, like, I've been dating this girl uh, for a while now. Five months, to be exact. But um, we just broke up the other day, and we're done. And I'm sad, and it sucks, but um, this way, it gives me more time to focus on what I actually can do for you guys. Because there were so many days of my days off where I, I literally couldn't record anything for you guys. And that's a big reason why you guys haven't been seeing a lot from me uh, as of late. It, and that was a huge reason was my girlfriend because, like, we went out all the time. And I would literally have no time to record anything. And uh, she'd sleep over a lot. And I just didn't have time to do that stuff for you guys. Especially with the fact that, like, I bought these programs and shit and all this new equipment. And I'm still learning this these things that I've bought and using them and learning how to use them. Uh, and, and that was a big thing because since I had no time to even record when I was hanging out with her, um, 
that meant I also had no time to learn the programs or anything either. Because I, if I can't record, I have no time to do that either, right? Uh, and that was, like, another roadblock aside from work. But now that we're not dating anymore, which, again, sucks and it's sad and I'm not happy about this. It's not like I'm like, woohoo, now I have more time to do stuff I want to do. It's not like that. Um, I am feeling, like, hurt from, from the whole thing. And I don't want to get too into detail because it was just a shitty situation how it ended. But um, I'm just saying that a plus side is now that I can now I can focus more time on this stuff. And all I know is I'm really happy doing it. So it'll be a good way to like put my time into something and take my mind off of all the bullshit. And it'll be fun, it'll be good, and I'll see good things for my channel that I'm still so serious about, guys. And I'm really hoping to grow as a YouTuber within within the next year. Uh, mainly at the start of, like, or towards the end of the year, I'm really hoping to, like, really grow and expand my channel. But we'll see. These are all hopes. Uh, YouTube is still something I'm very serious about, and I'm really hoping that all this stuff that I've put my time into and spent money on can really take me somewhere further with this. Because, honestly, my growth has been too slow for my liking, and I'm thankful for all the new subs and viewers that I got, but it's not enough. And I'm, I'm very ambitious when it comes to YouTuber. I mean, when it comes to YouTube... As a YouTuber, and I want more. I want to grow more. I want to be more popular on YouTube. I want better content. And, yeah, bottom line. So I'm working hard on getting that. And that's what my time is going to be focused on. But anyways, guys, this video has gone on long enough. Just expect my new video that I'm working really hard on to come out sometime really soon. And I really hope you guys enjoy it. But... Thank you guys for watching, and I will definitely see you in the next one. So have a good one.